Hi, I'm Dr. Nihar Parik, and with me is Dr. Harsh Vyas, Hi. an eminent pediatric dentist. And today we're going to embark on a journey to help you give your children the best healthy teeth. The final million dollar question. Children love sweets. They love their candies. They love their sugar. They love their cakes. How bad is it for their teeth? How do we make sure they get best of both the worlds? That is their lovely treats and healthy teeth. How can we help? Well, uh, you know, being a dentist, uh, I love my sugars. We all do, and I'm sure children love sugars too. So I, I have children coming in, and they've been tutored or or trained to say that they don't eat sugars or any chocolates. You know, when they sit first time on the dental chair, and of course, I have a little smile in my mind. But let me put it like this: Let's divide sugars into two types. One are the good sugars, and two are the bad sugars. Now, the good sugars are the ones that don't remain in the mouth for long periods of time. So things like a ice cream or a milkshake would pass through the mouth very quickly. On the other hand, the bad sugars are the ones which are sticky and retentive, and they get stuck on the teeth for long periods of time. Now, that's what causes basically tooth decay, okay, rapidly. So, for example, a candy. You mentioned candy, or you talk about a lollipop or an eclair or a sticky toffee. Now, if that is the one which is ingested, then that causes okay a chances of decay because of the fact that it gets stuck for long periods of time. So, what we need to do is try and give our child good sugars. So, things like uh, milkshakes, ice creams, even milk chocolates. Okay, those are relatively less sticky as compared to a caramel chocolate. So, keep this in mind. Second, very important thing is the is is the timing of giving sugars. You can give. You know, sugar any amount at one go, okay, once a day. So it could be a sugar treat for the child. So it could be a sugar treat meal. The child knows when they're going to get it, and they prepare for it. So what you need to do is decide the time of the day when you're going to give them a little treat. Now, most parents would want to say, for example, if I was to give a child an entire slab of chocolate, most parents would say, have two pieces at nine in the morning, two at twelve, two at three, two at five, and so on and so forth. Now, I recommend. The child has the entire slab of chocolate, all of it at one go, and feel completely satisfied. That is basically the way that you can minimize the harmful effects of sugar without causing dental decay. So one sugar treat a day and the use of non or or giving a child non-sticky sugars is the concepts that are very important. Tune into our channel, Child and You, for tips and guidance to raise a healthy child. Live now, live healthy, only with Shushruta. For any queries, you can write into us on or WhatsApp us on.